Huh, that's kind of weird. I'm getting some terrible bitrate. I don't know why. I literally have nothing else running. Huh. Uh, anyways. Hi, welcome back. Uh, I don't know how it looks live, but... Ooh, that's not good. I'm sure it looks fine, right? <laughs> That's so weird, my... Okay, whatever. Hi, welcome. Welcome to the stream. Uh, it's been a while. For lack of a better word. It's, uh, it's been... How long has it been, actually? Uh, oh, 13 days ago. That's kind of bad. Eh. So yeah. I've been... I've been around, I guess you could say. Um... First and foremost. Uh, you might notice a lack of a webcam. I'm not exactly in a presentable state, as you might say. So I hope this... This is sufficient. Boom. I spent like... 30 minutes in Photoshop putting it together. Because I thought it would be funny. <laughs> uh, but yeah. It's been... It's been... It's been something. I don't know. Let's get into the game and then I'll talk a little bit more about what's been going on. Uh... Oh yeah. Oops. Forgot about the timer. Uh, my main concern right now is why the bitrate is so bad when literally nothing is happening. And also, why? The threshold is so low. I thought I fixed this. How's that? Oh, that's way, way better? Is that way better? I don't know. How's that? I think that actually is the best. Okay. Sorry. You would think after streaming for such a long time, uh, everything would just be good to go, but you'd be mistaken. Okay. Uh, story mode. Players who want to focus more on the story. New to melee action games. Desire a challenge. Demanding combat experience. Uh, I've heard this game is a lot like Dark Souls. <laughs> the Dark Souls of Star Wars games. So I'm, I'm gonna put it on Jedi Knight. I've heard a lot of good things about this game. And I've never had an excuse to play it before. So I thought... May the 4th? More like, may I play Star Wars? Ha! Uh,
Is this some of that Mongolian throat singing I've heard so much about? Listen, I don't want to upset your rhythm, Cal, but the boss wants a word. <laughs> That's literally me. It's gonna be good for us. Here he is, Chief. An error has been detected on line 10A. All our clamps are jammed. I need two workers to climb up and secure the cables. That's not an easy maneuver. The gal will double your pay for this shift. Why, Cal? What's her score? That couldn't hurt. Huh? Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Get to work. This way. I'm right behind you. Oh, yeah. I completely forgot to pull up my chat again. Uh, sorry. Give me, like... Give me, like, a second here. It's been... quite the growing pain that I've been going through. I've completely changed my setup, like... twice... in these past few days. So it's like... Oh yeah, that's right, I have to do that. <laughs> I completely forgot. But alright, there we go. That's... that's fixed. So this is a Jedi? Huh. Oh, I know what that is. Is that a gunship in the background? Uh, so yeah, if you don't know, I'm quite the Star Wars otaku. I'm never gonna say that again. At least out loud. Uh... I was not that big of a Star Wars fan. Surprisingly enough, when I was... smaller. Oh, that's a gunship. For sure. That's pretty cool. Uh... But for some reason, something in my brain just clicked. And like, suddenly... Uh... I was watching all the Star Wars movies on repeat. I got like this DVD box set for one of my birthdays and it was like episode one through three and then the separate box set that had episode four through six and I'd watch those movies like constantly and I just got so ingrained in the lore playing all the oh <laughs> okay these developers really don't hold your hand That's good to see. Uh, so yeah. I'm a big prequel stan. Don't at me. And uh... Yeah. I love- I love all the Clone Wars stuff. So... It's really a shame that a lot of the new Disney stuff doesn't have Clone Wars. But... It is what it is, right? To each their own, I guess. I was thinking about streaming a lot of Star Wars stuff this month. Don't worry about it. Uh, but up here, I've been. that every time. Remember the old days? Our gear. Hey, what up, dude? Yeah, those were the days. <laughs> I was gonna say that's some nice hair, but that's a hat. Uh, oh yeah, I was gonna stream a lot more Star Wars stuff this month, but I've kind of been in a bad state of mind for a while, and I kind of had to force myself to play today. Stream. I haven't seen a Luke or Hulk in ages. Yeah. Ages. Breaking her will be big money. Oh, it's that... It's that droid right. ship. Let's go. From my favorite movie, Episode 1, The Phantom Menace. It's a shame my webcam's not on. <laughs> See the biggest grin on my face when I said that. Heads up! 
Hey, you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Ladder's out, though. I'm gonna have to find another way. And no problem. I'll improvise. Another there, way? Bro. This is blinking, so that means I should go this way. Uh, yeah, I was thinking of, like, Battlefront 2 playing with... Immediately. You are not approved trash. And trash? She's not approved trash. Oh. Real. God, that is so real. <laughs> I was thinking of streaming some Battlefront 2, the old one, playing with whoever decides to join. Uh, you know, some original Battlefront, some of that new Battlefront, this game. I've got some, I've got a, like a whole bunch of old Star Wars games in my Steam library that I just don't have an excuse to play. So I was like, yeah, this might be a good excuse. And, uh, yeah. We're close to finishing ahead of schedule. I can just about taste the credits. Hey! It's gonna be a wild night tonight. Let's get this job done. I recognize that voice. Uh, where do I go from here? It's not that way. I feel like a game journalist. Um. Do I jump over there? Oh, I have to. Yeah, okay. Clearly. All right. Reckless cow. Good to see you. Hey. You too. Don't get yourself killed. That's the idea. Yeah, she wants me. Uh, yeah. I thought about all this stuff like on like at midnight, April thirtieth. So I was like, this isn't gonna happen. But uh, you know. I couldn't miss May the 4th. I've been, like, rearranging my setup rats. for a while. Creepy. Just which is why. Through, guys. No need to come out and say hi this time. I spent, like... A couple days ago, just... Rearranging all my furniture. And, uh... Changing the setup for the stream. I mentioned before that I've got a second PC just laying around. Laying around. I was gonna say laying about. Hey Cal, I'll meet you at the clamps. Sounds good. Be there soon. But I, I can't get rid of this hiss noise. And plus, the room that I'm in, I have already like tripped the breaker like two or three times. <laughs> so I'm kind of afraid of. Well, Having the setup just like crash midstream. So until I, I fix some things, I'm gonna have to uh, put that on hold. But I've been how'd you get here? Spending a whole bunch of time just getting that to work, just for it to be like, yeah, I, I don't think so. Oh, <laughs> cow! You were supposed to grab. Here. There it goes. Man, look at that Venator. And all its glory. Hey, yep, good looking out. Oh, are those Oh, hey. ATTEs? 
all-terrain transport something. And the gunships? The gunships are my favorite. Oh! Speaking of gunships... And, oh, and I didn't even see the clone trooper helmets. That is awesome. <laughs> oh, the AT... RTs, I want to say. Yeah, in my mind, the gunship, the clone gunship, and the space shuttle are like on equal terms, equal grounds of, like, just awesome. And I never got a chance to play this game. I never had an excuse, I guess you could say. So here we are. Hurry, we gotta finish before they start cutting this wing. Action A, action A! I'm working as fast as I can. Isn't that <laughs> how'd that guy get up here? This is probably super old news for everybody. But this is just awesome to see. Cal, use the manual override lever below. Okay. I'm gonna think it's this? Got it. Your turn. <laughs> Hold on! Alright. Hmm. Lab secured. I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say you okay? this seems very oh, yeah. unsafe. Uh, give me a fright there, pal. <laughs> Done. Hang on. I got this. Uh, we're done. Get out up here. Come take a look at this. It's a Jedi fighter. Wow. A score. It's a real scrap and payday. I mean, this thing's been here, what, four years? Five. <laughs> Never flew this, but down on a blaze of glory. Those Jedi. Real tragedy. Yeah, I've always said they couldn't all be traitors. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be careful where you say that, buddy. Empire's gonna get a lot of good material out of it. Yeah. Here we are, scrapping these ships from the war, just so they can turn around and make new ones. What a racket, huh? <laughs> All of us risking our necks for the bosses. And the pay was better back during the Republic, too. Hey, you really should watch what you say. Well, listen to me. Find us free like this? Could be your ticket off this soggy rock. What makes you think I want out of here? <laughs> Come on, Cal, you're a young guy. You don't end up like me. <sighs> Eventually, you gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Oh. Whatever you say. Hey, we should get back down. You're not listening to me, though. Who's that? Oh! Also, you've got to think. This starfighter is just like on the top of the ship. How did nobody see that before? Like Plinko. Ah! Uh. you okay? No, I, I can't climb up. Bro, just hang on. Can't me. No. no. Don't let go. I, I can't hold on. Bro, no. Yeah. 
Okay, we gotta... We gotta move. Come on. What the hell happened? What was that back there? Was that you? I don't know what you're talking about. But that, that was the force, wasn't it? Just forget what you saw, okay? Please no, trust me. I've seen, the, I've, I've seen the stories. I've heard it. The bounties out on people I like know. you. I know. Yeah, we're ready. We need to be careful. Yeah. Yeah. Literally, don't mention this to anybody. Like, literally. Like, literally, <laughs> you can repay me that way. This place, it's unsafe. Maybe you should, you know, disappear. Just gonna head back to my place, grab my bag. Tapper owes me a favor. Huh. I heard he was up on the Nashidoa. Yeah. What? You'll be seeing me for a while, prof. That place sounds familiar. Yeah, okay. Okay, Kel. Oh, he disappeared. Just like... Like a force ghost or something. Was this all just a figment of my imagination? Oh. He was the mentor that I sorely needed, and I was imagining it all? <laughs> Prof, wait up! <laughs> hey! Hey! What?! Um, okay. I didn't know this was turning into Silent Hill for some reason. Hey, this door isn't opening. <laughs> and maybe I should use the force and open it or something. Conductor, we have a problem. Oh, and that's a sick transition. I know who those guys are. <laughs> Move out and line up. Probably just another contraband inspection.
Hey! It's a TIE Interceptor. They don't just give out those to whoever. Is this all of them? Yes, second sister. We seek a dangerous fugitive. This is no common anarchist, but a devotee of the treasonous Jedi Order. <sighs> Failure to turn over this traitor will result in a charge of sedition. Turn yourself in. Or everyone present shall face summary execution. Or it travels fast, apparently. I think it's time someone came forward. I, uh, I am Hercules. I've been working on this heap a long time. Way before the war. Refit and rebuilt ships. Best in the galaxy. Then came the Empire. <laughs> and engineers became scrappers. The workers? They just started getting worked. Prof. We all know the truth. It's very inconspicuous. We're just too afraid to say it. To the Empire, we're all just expendable. Yes, you are. No! Look at this, a lightsaber. I found the Jedi. <laughs> This is kind of awkward. <laughs> hey, easy now. Am I gonna make any sudden movements? Okay, that was more anticlimactic than I thought it would be. But okay, okay. I can see the story is starting to pick up now. You hear that over the comm? Jedi? Stay sharp. They won't get past us. The traitor, blast them! That's, that's not possible. Contact confirmed. Shoot to kill. I don't need help to kill you. Hostile, get ready! Not if I steal the cargo door. Don't let up! <laughs> Um. Oh, I, I have to cut these. <laughs> break your guard. A very emergent gameplay. Okay. Think I'm getting the hang of this. One way out. I don't think I was supposed to. Uh. Jump down here. Okay. It's still pretty cool so far. Gotta keep moving. I can see why people like this game. Although I do have high expectations. I chose to rest instead. Knowing That's that how That's how you prepare for death. Rest when you're dead, Stormtrooper. He's a scout trooper, okay. 
Oh, even the stormtroopers aren't... ...aren't lore accurate. That's fail RP, dude. I'm gonna report you to the admins for fail RP. You're a scout trooper, not a stormtrooper. Okay. <laughs> I've had it with the server. Anyways. Ah, oh. Did you hear that too? It's all over now. Uh, knowing how. Oh, what? Knowing how the Force Unleashed handles its gameplay. I'll get through. Can't take a hit. Uh, I can only hope that they improved. Appears above the enemy or whatever. Get to the front. Stop the train. And even the barrels are like all in yellow for some reason. Like somebody painted over them. Oh no! Need cover. Uh, Got to move in between bursts. Now. They finally tell me what the sprint button is. Stuff like Candy Crush? No. If it had explosions, then it'd be a real game. She looks 
looks like a stranger I can trust. I mean, there is like... Everybody's trying to kill me, so... I guess anybody that tries to help is good. A very Uncharted-like, I've been noticing. Or like, Assassin's Creed-like. I'd still say this is like... Like Uncharted. <laughs> A lot of climbing on things that are, for some oh, reason, falling no. apart. Jedi. What now? Also, I'm like almost dead. Do I not regen health? Stuff? Do I need to find some health packs or something? Some back to tanks. Game looks incredible, by the way. Now this can't be good. Whoa! Uh, it totally looks better than anything those fools at Dice could do with Battlefront over at EA. Oh wait, this is an EA game, isn't it? Jump now! Hold on! <laughs> no! It still looks nice, but like I've mentioned before, uh, a game that looks nice but plays bad is still a bad game. Somewhere. I recognize that stance. Perhaps you've had some training after all. Who is your master, Padawan? Someone I killed, perhaps? What Jedi gave their life so that you might live? Uh, weirdly enough, she seems kind of hot. I will destroy you. <laughs> Come this in. is me in real life running away from women. You can't run forever. I'm like almost dead. This is like the first boss in every Dark Souls game that forces you to die in order to progress. Ah! Uh. Thing off and grab some seat. Thanks for the help. But who are you people? My name is Sir Junda, and this is my captain, Priest Ritus. 
How you doing? Yeah, the man this is my ship, but you better pay attention to this lady here. So, who are you? Cal, Kestis. Who was that back there? An Imperial Inquisitor. She's a Force user hunting Jedi survivors. And now that she knows who you are, she will not stop until she destroys you. How do you know so much? And why'd you help me? We track Imperial communications. We heard the Inquisitors were heading to Brock. So we made our move. Oh, yeah? Well, it's the bounty on Jedi these days anyway. That's gratitude for you. Look, I get it. You've been surviving on your own for so long that it's impossible to trust anyone. And it's what's kept you alive. But this is about something bigger than just surviving. Like what? Like rebuilding the Jedi Order. Here we go. You too. Anybody else? Oh, we're not good enough for you? The Jedi Council? They're gone. Oh. So I'm all you've got. Captain, set a course for Bagano. In the meantime, try and relax. Go, you're safe. For now. You gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Calico! You were talking in your sleep. And you were watching me? Weirdo. <laughs> you were you were the one watching me sleep, dude. And I'm the weirdo? <laughs> cool. Alright. I assume this is where I put upgrades into my Jedi lightsaber. I've actually seen, like, very little about this game. I've seen, like, uh... Was it some gameplay of some guy, like, climbing on some planet? So I'm kind of interested to see where this game goes. Oh, and I think I also saw the ending of it. <laughs> and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. It's an echo in the force from the object. Not many Jedi have that skill. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi, but not anymore. My connection to the force has been cut. But I knew your master, Jaro Tapal. He was a true guardian of the Republic was a hero. Listen. Something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but my connection to the Force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when... You survived, Cal. And you're not alone. Not anymore. We'll come up on our destination. Bogano. More like Oregano. Haha. <laughs> this is Bogano. 
A Jedi I knew discovered it before the Purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists. No. So? Not until that tracking device that out, Inquisitor put on the ship, that We're is. Done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I'm just guessing here. I know you don't trust me. <laughs> uh, but I feel like it's sure going to go in that direction. You. But we have a common enemy and a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the force be with you. Yoda? I'm going to meet Yoda? The Yoda? I'm looking for a Jedi then. But if there's already one here, why does Seer need me? Hmm. I see that. I see that town. Like a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus my mind. Hmm. How convenient that there's just this pattern here. Oh, save point. Save points are located throughout Cal's journey. So it's like the bonfire. <laughs> Overhead slash. Deadly against weaker enemies. Okay. Since this is what the game wants me to do. Oh. Also, that guy just got cut in half. And he's still alive. Erm. Um, I don't think that's how lightsabers work. Okay. Rest. Oh, okay. So if I die, I get like sent back to the the nearest checkpoint or something. And the only way I can regain my health is by hey, BD1. I'm Cal. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi. I think. Hold on. Y you know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, hold on! Did you just slice that? Thanks. Hmm. What a quirky character. Ah! <laughs> uh. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna be petty and rest so I can get my sliver of health back. There ain't no way I'm gonna continue on at less than my maximum. <laughs> Can't believe Cal just jumped off like that. That's the Vault Seer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. Ooh. Okay, so now he's joining me, I guess. Try experimenting with the hollow map controls. Hollow map, more like hollow. Um, hollow something. I'm not big into the VTuber scene. I only know Hollow, because I follow this this one Instagram account. 
Okay. Ah! Any ideas? Got to get across this gap somehow. A zip line? <laughs> Whoa! How'd you know that would work? Wait, you didn't? Cool. I guess it's like an autosave or something. All right, I'm liking this. I'm liking this so far. Is the exposure up? Do you think it's too bright? I hear you, but there's something over here I want to explore. Oh, and apparently this is the wrong way to go. Uh, I might feel like... I bump up the brightness. Because I know I... It's, oh yeah, that looks way better. Uh, playing RE4 without the brightness super up. Uh, not exactly the smartest thing, especially when I'm wearing sunglasses. So... I hope it, it looks better. Uh, where do I go from here? this place to study the sphere above I can still feel the excitement I can feel the power um how do I oh I have to no I jump up somewhere oh probably through these vines That's the wrong way. Uh, oh, okay. So yeah. Uh, this game design is getting kind of hard to follow. Especially since they keep changing it up on me, but... So far I'm liking it. <laughs> I can see why people call this the Dark Careful, Souls of Star there. Wars. That doesn't look safe. Just like back at the scrapyard. Oh. Hold on, Jimmy. I'm coming. It's that thing. I think I wasted, yeah, all my force. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that mechanic. I would think being able to use the force in gameplay, or I should say in combat, would be kind of integral to playing as a Jedi. Uh, but I... I guess I don't know too much about that, apparently. Whoever lived here used this room for storage. They kept food and supplies. Hmm. Our Lord and Savior, Gonk. Nice to see an appearance from him. That was pretty brave. You okay? <laughs> Wait. I can help you with that. Will you let me? I can fix that. Oh. <laughs> okay. This droid is very trusting for someone just met, like, five minutes well, ago. Your scomp is busted, but this should help you get moving for now. Oh. 
Okay. Try that. The vault? Yeah, that's where I was headed, too. Okay. Well, first we've got to figure out a way out of this place. Yeah, let's customize this thing. <laughs> Hear that doge in the background? Oh, oh, orange premium content. My Gito Umbaran. I thought I fixed the, the threshold on this. Why is it still picking up? Hmm. Whatever. Nice to know that the Jedi used premium content stuff for their lightsabers. Yeah, ain't that a beaut? <laughs> Sweet. I got this game for like five dollars, by the way. It was on sale like That's a little small for me. A couple weeks ago. I'll find my own way out. And it was like tight fit. It was like three dollars for the base game and five for like the deluxe version. Okay, I'll buy the deluxe for five dollars. I think it might have been like five or seven. Those vines look like they lead somewhere. Hope they're sturdy. <laughs> oh, it's not at all what I thought I was jumping onto. You hear that doge? <laughs> kind of what I expected. Yeah, I'm all right. That's better. Thanks, little droid. And there's my Estus flask. Okay, let's try this again. I've never played Dark Souls, by the way. Oh. Uh. <laughs> I just know all those references because okay. they're so ingrained in <laughs> meme culture. Hop on board. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll play Dark Souls. Haven't found a reason to, so, but. How'd you get here? I see why the comparison. I don't remember. I've never known a forgetful droid. Can't argue with that. Hey, a chest. Think the Jedi would mind if we grab supplies? Did you find something, BD-1? That's where we need to go. I can feel it. It's also the only structure that's large enough to eclipse anything else in the vicinity, so... I guess besides that... It's honestly pretty scary. It's a little unnerving looking at that thing. Hey. 
Scanning again? What's that? You mapped everywhere we've been. Kinda not liking how I have to specifically do the things there. that it asks me to in order to progress, way. but okay. Yeah, I've been wanting to close the hollow map for a while. I wonder if that's an option I can turn off. I don't need any help. Okay, so by the way, where are we going now? <laughs> uh, that looks like a force thing. So if I... Wah! I feel like in reality, if I were to jump... ...land on this one part of this whole thing... Uh, I would shift the balance of it, and I'd just go... ...flying off down, but... This is Star Wars, after all. Oh, it's just meditate. Restore life and force. Resting is not required to save your progress. Let's actually check out the skill tree. Uh, what? Am I working towards? What overpowered abilities am I uh, looking to gain? Evasive kick? Wah! Sprint strike? <laughs> Running gif? And then strike? Running dot gif? Or is it GIF? Where are you going? Oh, something was in there. Ooh, a poncho material. I saw this clip, I guess, of uh, the guy who plays Cal being like, I wasn't going to reprise my role unless there was going to be a poncho involved. And I thought that was kind of funny. This tool was used by someone eager to reach the vault. There's a box over there. I think that's a box. Oh, scan. Just trying to press like R3 on it. <laughs> oh, that's huge. Run for it. Oh, that's not something you can climb. <laughs> that totally does look like you can climb that. <laughs> no? Oh, with the force. Oh, I guess I'm not strong enough yet. Force! Force this! Ah! Oh. That's right. And now can I scan this? Ah, 
Okay, oh, now I can. Oh, scan that. Bruh. Good job. And not this huge thing that I killed. Another one? Oh, and now it's gone. Time for a stim. Okay. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh! Okay, I swear that's not on purpose. Uh, it also feels like... I can't climb that yet? Yeah, this- oh. Cal, you can totally put your fingers on that. And lift yourself up. No, yeah, the rock thing that looks like you can climb it is totally not climbable. But the plants? Yeah, you can climb those. <laughs> Ooh, can I wall... wall run like in Titanfall? No. Okay, you heard it here, f like, three years late. You cannot ru wall run in Fallen Order. Uh, I'd say a big reason why I decided to play this game now is since that new game just came out. I can't exactly start with the new game, right? Especially when... It's a sequel. I've got to play the old one first. So... Play the sequel. I mean, uh, play the prequel. Prequels are better. And then, uh, at some point... You know... Then we play the game that came after, which... I would assume... Improved on a whole lot of gameplay stuff. I've heard the PC port is, like, terrible. Which, uh, knowing EA doesn't exactly surprise me. Alright, let's rest. Can't climb that. So I don't even- where am I even going? I'm just going deeper and deeper down. Yeah, can't wall run. See something in there? Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Now, do what you must to reach me. The dude is wearing Anakin's armor from the Clone Wars. Remembering old tricks. Immediately fails.
Well done. <laughs> Bruh, that does not look that steep. I could probably walk up like at least halfway up that. Then again, I'm no Jedi. Well, then again, shortcut again, even Cal couldn't just walk up that without immediately getting slid down. That's loud. I see now. I still feel like Cal could just climb up that. But okay. this bag brought it from Coruscant. They were frustrated with the Jedi Council. I see your tricks, developer. <laughs> That's kind of weird that the camera would just clip in on this specific wall. Hmm, that's pretty sure I'm not the first person to discover that. But okay. I'm liking all the little bits of lore. I just love Star Wars lore. <laughs> oh, that's right, I can upgrade something. What can I upgrade? Slowest target, longer duration. The dash strike. Oh, maximum life. Obviously, we're doing that. Superior blocking. All right. Let us continue. We're about an hour into this now. An hour and 20. And, uh... I don't know how I feel about this game yet. I... Uh, a part of me wants to say, it's kind of boring. But on the other hand, uh, I've, I've barely played it at all. I'm only an hour into it. Oh, all right then. Did you find something, BD1? Ooh. So, I don't know. And of course, I can't do anything here. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, we're back up here. So, where am I going again? I have to get in there. But... Uh... I haven't gone up here. It's a really big bug. I don't think that's a bug. Listen, I'm no... Oh, that's a big bug. 
<laughs> it's kind of a weird place to say that. Trap me. I'll check it out. <laughs> oh, look, he's one. waving. <laughs> he's waving goodbye because he's been cut in half and his soul is leaving his body. Becoming one with the force, some would say. <laughs> This? Sorry about your stopping. But standing up to that bog rat, pretty brave. So I'd assume no, he can't. Let's check the map here for a second. Um... Going through that would take me... Up here? Wasn't I just here? Oh, I couldn't make the jump. That's why. But it looks like this is the right way to go. So, let's actually go in the opposite direction. If I can even go up. Doesn't seem like it. Or maybe not. I'm not gonna test that out. Racy there. Oh, it's on. Yeah, I'm not gonna race you there. I don't like doing things what what the game tells me to do. I'm gonna do my own thing. Have my own fun. Oh, you wanna race me there? Nah, I'm gonna go in the opposite direction. <laughs> oh, look at that cool. Look at that wicked fossil, man. Unless it's been carved out of nice job. stone. The structure of a bones. That doesn't look like I can do anything else here. Unless I jump down and repeat the process of making my way back up here. Uh, but... No, that door looks like it's locked. Eh. Let's live a little. <laughs> Unless we just went back in a circle. No, it looks like... It looks like it's a new area. Totally blocked. Oh. Alright, and that brought me back... ...to I don't know where. Oh, now I know. This was that one door. Okay. Cool. 
Uh, so while we're exploring here, I guess I can talk some more. Yeah, I think we're just gonna have to go straight to the Jedi Temple and see what's up there. Uh, so yeah, I've been... I've not been in the best state, <laughs> I guess you could say. <clears throat> and, uh, I've been rearranging my space here, where I have my computer. So I can record that one video I've been talking about. Still haven't filmed it. Because I keep wanting to change the setup and make it perfect. And a part of me knows that it's not going to be perfect, no matter what I do. But, uh, I don't know. We're not finished yet. Okay, okay, you probably would have won. Probably. But, uh... Yeah. I've been... doing some stuff here. Or working out, and... just playing some Modern Warfare. Been playing a lot of Modern Warfare, actually. <clears throat> I guess you could say... like, way too much, actually. <laughs> I've been playing okay, that new... Look. Trophy thing, that event. I'm trying to get some camos for my guns. And, you know, collecting all those trophies for those rewards has been a great incentive. What is going on with Cal's legs? He is a Jedi, after all. <laughs> so yeah, I've been up to that. And, uh... The more I... The more time I spend in between streams, the more I'm like... Do I really want to stream? And then I inevitably do stream, and I'm like... Why did I not do this sooner? So that's, that's been the cycle so far. Wake up, do whatever that needs to be done, go to sleep, repeat the cycle. Amazing. <sighs> I'll check it out. You all right, BD? Oh. Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Ino Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault. But Seems kind of weird, but okay. Test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. You know, 
I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hey. You want to meet some, uh, friends of mine? Hmm. A long time ago. So all of that was just for that one recording. Hey, I've left this holocron with a list of names. Uh, good luck. Not even like... Oh yeah, this is what the Jedi stand for. Or like... This is what it means to be a Jedi. Here are some sacred texts. It's like, oh yeah, here are some names. <laughs> Seems kind of like a weird thing to leave behind, I guess. I don't know how impactful that would be, especially since the Empire is like. I think I found what you wanted me to see. In uh. Sounds like you did. In control, we'll I guess you waiting. could say. Hey, is that thing? I tried blocking and my lightsaber didn't come up. Is it normal for... <laughs> like I've mentioned, I'm not a... I, I haven't played Dark Souls, okay? So... I, I'm not really used to the whole uh, parry system and everything, but is like, is the parry like not at all instant? You press the button and it takes like a second longer for the, the person to parry? Because I, I feel like good game design would have that kind of be, you press the button and it instantly happens. It doesn't wait for the character to do it. It just plays the animation. Or maybe that's like part of My friend, the the gameplay. It appears having to time Sefo it. Had some interest in death <gasps> it's strange. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. BD1, over here. Oh, he was telling me to do something over here. Yeah. Hmm. Faded mural? More like. Should be a lot quicker than the way in. <laughs> um. I was gonna do a lane reference, but never mind. <laughs> it's kind of the same issue I ran into speaking back on the parry thing. The same issue I ran into with RE4 Remake. I'd press the parry button and Leon would be like hit by someone and he wouldn't play the animation. And I'd be like, is this how it's supposed to be? Because <clears throat> it really doesn't feel like it's, it's that smooth. BD1. Uh, okay, that's... Thanks, computer, for having that pop up. That's not the way in. You passed the test. So you knew about BD-1? Come on board. 
We'll talk inside. Oh, BD1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Go! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of Batoli Reed fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of Force-sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. That little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a, minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He I don't think it'd be that simple, though. Death Mirror and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look. Before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe, I I believe in myself. Empire, so I don't really have. I believe in the me as long as you're alive, you will that believes in you. Have a choice. Are you? I'm sure it? somebody gets that reference. We're in. Death Mirror Zepho, it's your choice. Cool. So where are we going? Why are we dropping, boys? If you're not ready to leave, don't bother me. <laughs> I thought I could talk to him again. Wouldn't that be funny? I just keep pressing the same button and he keeps repeating the same dialogue. That's my kind of humor. <laughs> uh, let's see. What can I... Didn't I unlock some stuff? Oh, that's actually... I think that looks way better, actually. It's kind of like Obi-Wan's lightsaber. Eh... Not a huge fan of the exposed wiring on the end. Oh, yeah, huh. Um, wasn't his, like, lightsaber broken on that end or something? I just remembered that. Uh... I think... Let's just go with that. Yeah. <laughs> totally cutting into that. So where are we going now? I kind of want to go to Dathomir for no reason at all. Hey Grease, what's this thing? What? You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy hauling you around the galaxy, but you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. 
When it's out there, you betcha. But when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of embar and glass, <laughs> that's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can find any. Okay. Doesn't look like there's any glass there, though. Seer, can you feel the force at all? Yes. But instead of opening up, I push it back down. The exact opposite of what you should do. Out there. I remembered something about myself before the purge. It was painful, but like I found a piece of myself. Hold that thought. <laughs> Let's talk later, Cal. Okay. All right. So next. Hmm. Use the hollow table on the mantis? Main objective and the player location. Okay, so clearly we've got to go to Dathomir. Setting course for Dath. Wait a minute. You want to go to Dathomir? I'm surprised Cordova went there. He must have had good reason. I am staying put on the mantis <laughs> once we arrive. Red sunlight cannot be good for your skin. What? You got this a problem with red suns? A powerful cabal of force wielders known as the Night Sisters. Red sun. Force? What? Like Jedi? Red sun no. over paradise. Red sun. Powers focused on deception, illusion, manipulation. <laughs> Sounds like someone I used to know. During the Clone Wars, the Night Sisters made a deal with a Sith Lord who betrayed their trust. In the end, they were nearly wiped out in a massacre. Dathomir is a deadly place. We should be careful. Don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> ah, coming up on our creepy destination. Grab some seat, kid. All right. <clears throat> Let me grab some seat then. It's not creepy at all. Oh, I hate that red sun. <laughs> Cal, be careful here. I'll try to be. Oh man, I regret coming to this place. Ah! Oh. That's just disturbing to look at. It's like... It's like a black hole. I don't want to look at that anymore. <laughs> Can't climb that. Uh, am I not supposed to be here yet? Is that a, th a thing? Oh, maybe I should go this way. You see, I'm not so used to what this game wants me to do. Good thing we weren't standing there. Like... What is that thing? Oh, you should probably have this force power before you go to the planet. You know? What is it, boy? Oh. Burial pots.
What did this guy want? Oh, it was this thing. It's... Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. Having him just run off like that. Without letting me know he wants to scan something. I guess the only way is forward. So tough. Looks like a mini rancor. <laughs> I was actually kind of scared during that whole thing. Thanks for the help. It looks like this thing would have absolutely demolished me. Lesser Nidak? I just made a complete circle. Where am I going? Am I really not supposed to be here? Um... It looks like... That totally doesn't look like I can go that way. Good thing I have this map. Yeah, it's... Yeah, I can't jump up there? Oh. I'm dead. What happens now? <laughs> Respawn. I've technically died. You know, jumping off stuff. But what happens when I die? It sounds deep. Did everything just reset? Oh, <laughs> I, t I, in my defense, I keep pressing the button. <laughs> well, I could always use some more skill points. go. Man, you can still hear that doge outside. Toss it here. <laughs> ah! 
and totally missed every single one of those. <laughs> if it wasn't for that doge barking, I'd totally be talking right now. Let's go kill this thing first. Cool, I like that little uh, gameplay mechanic. Uh, so yeah. As I was trying to say before, <laughs> while we figure things out, um, I'd say the main thing is that I've just been in between stuff. And I need some meds for you one. Way too close. And uh I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I should be putting a priority on some things instead of what I'm doing. But... Hurry! Okay. But, uh... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, this was the same path. So where am I going? Oh. Uh. So yeah, I hope... You've been checking out the VODs. I've been spending some time... Just leaving my computer on idle. Getting all these... VODs uploaded. Uh, I recently just uploaded every single Metal Gear March video. What was in there? And uh would you be surprised to know that since I don't know when <clears throat> since I implemented the intermission screen and the ending screen, I've had no audio whatsoever. Can you believe that? I guess I should have led with that. Uh... Yeah. I set up all these things in OBS to just switch scenes into, and I thought... I thought, uh... Since the levels were going up in my audio mixer, that those scenes actually had audio being recorded to them. I don't know where I'm, where I'm going. This way. And I was uploading uh, the original RE4 videos, the randomizer that I did in February. And I was like, wait a second. Why is there no audio in, in the ending screen? So I, I brought it into Premiere and I was like, uh... There's no audio here. Like, completely. Like, at all. No audio was recorded. Oh! Dead.
Yeah, uh... I have my audio as a nested scene, so I just add the one thing instead of the million audio sources that I have. And I- apparently I didn't add them to the intermission or ending screen. So, whenever I had those screens on, there was just no audio and I had no idea about it. Until, like, the Modern Warfare 2 stream I did uh, on 420. So, uh, uh, I just can't imagine all the things that I, I said, or I was talking about, or the things I responded to with other people, and they just didn't hear it. Like, I know for sure, during the Metal Gear March ones, Um, in the MGS2 ah! These things are annoying In the MGS2 stream uh, Like the last Part of the game I was talking to some people Some chat members and I was responding to their questions, and I was like, oh yeah, by the way, I'm gonna end the stream now. And I pressed, uh, my ending screen, and I was like, all their, their messages kept coming up, so I was like, oh yeah, by the way, uh, I think this, or whatever. Er, by the way, uh, thanks for watching and everything. You missed him! And I was... I kept responding to them, I kept talking to them, and I was like, that's weird, they're not responding back, but I guess it is the ending stream. Screen. Stream. Stream. And... And I remember specifically, <laughs> on one stream, uh, one of my chat members was like, talking to me. And I remember the message specifically. It was like, oh, lol. Because I, I was like, I was like, oh yeah, by the way, thanks for watching. And then end screen. And uh, I responded to his question. I was like, or something. I think it was like, oh yeah, by the way, I got a, I got some ending music. And I played the ending music. And he was like, this place seems abandoned. Oh, lol. Oh. You trespass, Jedi. You must be a night sister. I had heard you were all dead. Not all. Dothamir is forbidden to you. Leave at once. Well, she I'm seems hot. I can't do that, but perhaps we could help each other. You see, I. Easy. I'm not your enemy. Your actions say otherwise. Wait, hold on. I'm not here to. Okay. Look there. This pain means nothing. I'm, I'm trying to talk here. I don't even have any stims. Thank you, developers, for the iframes. I'm dead. Uh. Or was I? Oh yeah. I was like, I gotta play some ending music. So I press the button and everything. Oh, okay, lol. And I was like, oh yeah, he's you're responding to the fact that I said I've got some ending music, right? And nope. <laughs> he said, oh lol, because I literally ended the stream and there was nothing else. This whole time, I've just been, like, cutting people off. And I was... Like, the, uh, the, the feeling of, like, guilt... That went over me when I discovered... <laughs> this whole time! This whole time... I've been inadvertently doing this to people. Kinda made me feel... 
Uh, very bad inside. And I guess, partly, you could say that's... Uh... Partly a reason why I didn't want to stream for a while. Because I was like... Like, really? Like, even after all the... The thought that I put into my OBS setup, there's still stuff that I... I'm obviously missing. Oh, I could have just done the shortcut, I forgot. Oh my god, I hate these things. There's no meditation thing here. Ugh. All right, time to fight these guys again. No, I've had enough of this, dude. You can't keep treating me like this. So yeah, it's uh, I hope you en enjoy the VODs, <laughs> especially how they awkwardly just cut out like that. Thankfully, I'll say, there I, ne I rarely use the intermission screen, and apart from a couple instances where I talk during the ending stream, uh, not much was missed, but, you know, some stuff was still missed. Some responses and whatever is just forever lost to time because my OBS apparently didn't want to record that audio. So it's, uh, it's kind of just weird. <laughs> weird to go back and be like, oh, I probably should have looked at this earlier. By the way, I think my PC is, like, heating up. <laughs> if you can hear some, like, something in the background, some fan. That's my PC fan. Uh, yeah, I don't know what to do about that. It's a hot room, and there's no ventilation. So... <sighs> it is what it is. Um... What else can I upgrade? Oh, that's right. I wanted to do that. Ah. Evasive kick. Cool. Thank you, Cal. Very cool. Uh, we've reached our two hours but oh that's the wrong way um hmm. I was gonna say we've reached our two hours which is usually the amount of time that I like to stream since I've got no reason to stream any more than that but I was gonna say, we should probably go for one more, like, meditation spot, but considering how that whole area 
took us forever, and this was the first one we came across. I don't expect there to be an, an, another one within like the next 20 minutes or so. So unfortunately, I'm just going to end the stream here. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> Let me jump off and get, try to get it. Uh, but anyways, thank you for watching. I appreciate the support. Um, I'm going to continue playing this game. This will not be the end of... This will not be the end of it. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to extend the Star Wars stuff throughout the whole month, considering how long this game takes us. Uh, I might have some, some other games planned, but thank you. Thank you for watching. Like, follow, subscribe if that's your sort of thing. And uh, I'll see you next time. I would say tomorrow, but the amount of times I've said tomorrow <laughs> and this stream doesn't happen is way too many to count. So I'll just say next time. Maybe tomorrow. But thanks. Hopefully I fix the ending. <laughs> the ending uh, audio. Ending screen audio. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time. See ya. I hope that audio has been fixed. If not, this is never going to be heard by anybody. Not even me. Because this audio is not being recorded. Unless it is, in which case you can hear this. And if you can hear this... Hey. How's it going? I'll see you next time.